Do you want invite rewards and message rewards in your Discord server? Well, stay tuned until the end of today's video so that you can learn how to do all of these things. But before that, make sure you're subscribed or at least check that you're subscribed as it would help me out a lot. And if you find the video useful, be sure to drop it a like. Be sure to join both Discord servers which are on the screen currently and yeah, let's just move on to the video. So, message and invite rewards, they're basically things that people get for maybe achieving a certain amount of invites or a certain amount of messages. And it can persuade your members to invite their friends or other people, and it can also make people send more messages, which will boost your server's activity. So the bot which we're going to use for this video is going to be Plasma, as you can see on the screen. I'll leave a link down below, and it's on top.gg. All you have to do is just click the invite button right here, it'll take you to this page, and you just got to sign into your account. So you want to click this box here, and select the server which you're going to invite the bot to, so it will be the video test server for me. So click that and go to continue, and then you want to just give it the administration permission because it needs to actually do things, so let's just click authorize, and then just verify yourself as a human, which I've already done, and then it goes straight back to your Discord. So once we're in the Discord, you can see Plasma is in the server, and we're just going to now set up the roles which you're going to need to like give the people when they reach that certain milestone. So you want to open up your server settings, which is by clicking this arrow here and go to server settings. Then go to roles and then you're just going to create the role which they will receive when they reach that certain milestone. So you can make different ones such as 100 messages or maybe like regulars or top inviter or like insane inviter. I don't know. You can name them how you want, but I'm just going to do these quickly and I'll be right back. So once you've done all this, make sure to click save changes at the bottom here. With the roles you can be as creative as you want, as you can see mine aren't really that creative but if you can have a creative mindset it'd be like quite cool and people might strive more to try and achieve those roles if they seem pretty cool. One thing you want to make sure though is that the plasma role is above all of these roles that you just created so that the plasma bot can actually grant the user that role. So now all you're gonna have to do is just the following commands so what you need to do, you go to your bot commands channel, as you can see here. So for the message rewards, we're going to use the command dot rank space message space add and then the role name, so at active member in my case. And then you're just going to put the number of message which they need to have to receive the role. So for me, it's going to be 50. Then you just press enter and there you are. It's made the rank so when you have 50 messages, it will literally just give you that role. You can now just do this for all your other ones, so I'll just make a time lapse of this quickly. So I've done that, and you can literally add as many as you want. I suggest adding as many as you can, or as many as you want, because it's going to persuade people to use your server and maybe make it more active, because people are going to keep messaging there, they have a goal to work towards, so it's just quite cool. So now we're going to do the invite rewards one, which is just simply dot rank space invite space add the role name, so for me, it's just going to be the inviter. You don't have to add this uh, bracket 2 plus invites thing. I just did that to make it easier for me. So then I'm just going to put the number of invites I need to have, which is just going to be 2. So press that, and you can see it's just made the inviter rank for 2 invites. So then you just do this for all your other invite ranks. So I'll make a time lapse of this. So there you are. That's just how you set that up. Now, another thing you can do is to make it so they can check the number of messages and invites they have. So for example, if I do dot messages, you can see I have seven messages in the server. And down here, it displays the number of messages which I need to get the next role reward. For me, I'm 43 messages from active member. You can also do this for the invites. So dot invites, you can see I have zero invites, meaning I have two more invites to get the invite to roll. So that's it. That's literally how you do it. It's dead easy and it's just another thing you can add to your server. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to drop a like and also subscribe and I hope this helps you guys. Be sure to leave any questions you might have in the comments section below and I'll be sure to answer them. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!